I used to think that resisting the passage of time would lead to misfortune. But I didn't realize then that adapting to the times and not having things under control are two separate issues. My skin was getting very dry, and I read somewhere that it might be because I was washing my face too much. So I switched to washing my face just once a day and started using Nivea. Was I doing it wrong, or was it just not working for my skin? Either way, my face was getting drier and drier. After digging around a bit, I realized my skin might be drying out under the layer of Nivea cream. So I went back to washing my face twice daily, but I swapped out my morning cleanser for something else. This is the cleansing foam I usually use, and I've been using it often enough to buy it again and again. But with my skin feeling this dry, I decided to give cleansing water a try in the mornings. Although this one had a higher ratings, I chose to start with a cheaper cleansing water to see if it was good fit for my skin. I used cleansing water for washing my face, not for removing makeup, so I needed something to help turn it into foam. Even with a few cloudy days, spring was unmistakably in full bloom. Since everyone stresses the importance of sunscreen, I am making a commitment to regularly apply the sunscreen I've been ignoring. This sunscreen I have does double duty as a lotion and I've been sticking to it. But I also picked up another one with the higher SPF. I found out that using cleansing oil is essential for removing sunscreen, so I bought this too. As expected, there was a higher rated option as well, but since I'm new to cleansing oil, I went with the cheaper one for now. While I didn't have any issues with using the cleansing oil, I didn't quite like the scent of this particular one. The weather's been so nice lately, I've swapped out yoga for jogging. After realizing I needed to also protect the backs of my hands from the sun, I bought UV blocking gloves to wear while running. I had to keep checking my watch while running, so I got gloves with cut-off fingertips. Funny how buying one thing always leads to needing something else. I don't know why, but this stuff made my face itch a little. Still, I managed to use up the sleeping mask that was left. I opened the new sleeping mask I bought during my trip to Korea a while back. My face stung and felt dry because my skin barrier was damaged. So I made sure to use this skin barrier strengthening cream every single day for the whole month. After my skin got better from being dry, I switched to a lighter cream for my face and used a stronger one around my eyes before bed. I wasn't hoping for a huge change in about a month but after paying attention, the dryness on my face definitely improved. It was quite interesting to manage, record every day, and observe improvements, even if only I could feel them. Booster mode, level one. Drop this. Hmm. Here you go.